Hey guys, it's Jessie with Lost Marbles Farm. It's been forever since I've done a video. I know, and I'm, I'm really, really behind. I've got a lot of cover, I, a lot of things I need to share with you guys to get you up to date. But I'll tell you the honest truth. The reason why I stopped doing videos is because my phone had absolutely no room on it. And um, I didn't want to delete any of the videos or pictures that I had on there. So I was trying to upload them onto the computer and some of them went and some of them wouldn't go and it was just a disaster. I don't know anything about technology, but if somebody has a tip on how to actually make it work, please share it with me. But anyway, I've got a new phone and I've got lots and lots of room on it. So now I'm back and running, um, but life is still crazy. Anyway, I just wanted to do uh, my first video back showing, because this is what I'm dealing with right now is our three does are about to kid. Um, I think the first one to go is Jolene. So let me show you her. Okay, here's Jolene. I have her on the calendar as she's due today. And she has bagged up a lot. If you can get a picture of those udders. I mean, she has really bagged up. And I always check twice a day their ligaments. So I'll, I'll grab right here and feel, see, I can barely feel her ligaments, which are like, they're like diagonal coming off the bone right here. Usually you feel them real prominent when they get really close to having their kids. You can do, and it's like, you could almost put, touch your fingers underneath their bone right here. It's so squishy. But I definitely think she's got at least twins. Sorry, my door, it's haunted. Woo! Now the wind picks it. Let me wait for it to stop. Okay, are you done? Okay. Anyway, um, I think she's going to be the first one to go. Franny over there, her mama, is also huge. And I think she's definitely got twins. Let me just get up and show you the other girls. <clears throat> um... So, real quick, for those of you that are new to the channel, Franny is the oldest, okay? She's probably about seven. Um, her daughter is six. This is Jolene. Um, and then her babe, no, 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 I'm sorry, my bad. Delilah, that's Eva's goat, is her baby as well. So, Delilah and Jolene are stepsisters. <coughs> and... They're all three pregnant by Boots. Uh, Boots is our buck. Let me should I should say was. So that brings me to other news, y'all. So the other day, I came out here in the morning to feed, and Boots wasn't there. And I had Boots and Boudreaux, my weather goat, in the pen that the girls are in right now. So they were like right outside the door. <clears throat> Nothing unusual about the day, but they're always together. Anyway, I look down the fence line, and Boots is dead as a doornail. Lean up against the fence. Just laid up on the ground against the fence. Let me shut this door. I have no idea what happened. No clue. Um, I know there's something about they can get something with your, your ureter stones or something like that. But he never called out for pain. Plus, I give him this stuff in his... Let me just show you. I can't remember the name of it. This stuff. I sprinkle a little bit of that, which I was told, if you put that in their feed, um, that helps. And I had been sprinkling that, and not every single time, but periodically I would put that on there. So I don't know if that was it. I don't know. He, he wasn't wormy. Um, I don't know if he had a heart attack. Anyway, it broke my heart because I really liked Boots. He was a great buck. Great. He wasn't aggressive. Um, he stank, but they all stank. And he made beautiful babies. So, these babies that these girls are having are the last of Boots' line. And I'm so sad because he was such a good buck. So, I'm on the hunt for... I'm not sure yet if I'm going to buy another buck or just borrow a buck. I haven't decided that. I don't have to make a decision until November. But 
It has to be from good milk lines. I don't care about registering my animals because I'm not, I, I'm, that's just not our program. Our program is I want good milk goats. Don't care if they're registered. I want them to have good milk lines, but I don't care. Isn't that right, Franny? Say, we don't need a registry to tell us we're awesome, do we? No, we're awesome anyway. All right, Miss Delilah. I thought she was going to go first, but she is not showing um, signs of being closer to labor. But she could be one of those last-minute girls. We do everything last minute, kind of like I was when I was having babies. Um, but she definitely, her milk bag is like, it tripled overnight. So, we are on baby watch. And maybe... We'll wake up with the surprise. You think, Jolene? What do you think? I don't think you think much at all. I'm sorry. Did I insult you? <clears throat> well, I'm excited. This is my favorite time of year, y'all. So, I will keep you guys updated and um, posted. So, check us out on Instagram and Facebook so you can see the latest. All right, you guys. Take care.